Hi guys and welcome to Off the Couch. It's a beautiful day outside and I have my assistant here, Ryder. No, he's not going to do much, but he's a cute puppy, isn't he? <laughs> and today we're going to build a futon. This futon comes from Walmart. You won't believe the price, so stick around. I will reveal it at the end of the video. It's super affordable, that's all I have to say. It comes from Luxury Goods and we're about to build it hopefully it's gonna be a quick easy assembly by the way it ships straight to your door free delivery okay. like i said at an affordable price so everything you want in this one box all right let's do this Okay, so here are a few tips if you want to install this correctly. It's super easy to install by the way, but make sure that when you get this box, um, somehow it needs to be flipped to the back, so you need to find the back of the couch because this is where everything is hiding inside those two zippers in the back. So start with the back and then once you locate the tools, actually all you need are we need to find is this bag full of screws, one L wrench. Once you screw in all the way to the end, at the very end, this is when you like tighten the legs. Once you have located the two zippers and the tools, the little bag, and then a bag full of um, legs, four legs, two in the front, two in the back. Now, now it, this is the bag, right? So when you see this extra piece right here this is how you know this is your sign on where to put the legs correctly now the straight ones i'm gonna call them straight because these are like kind of not straight okay so these will go on this side two on the front or that top side and then the tilted ones on the back side okay i'm gonna start screwing them in and um, hopefully this would be it so all right let's do this so every single leg you will need two of these and then two of those all right let's do this another thing about the manual it's all pictures i mean there's nothing to read so i will tell you you need two legs screws wash screwdriver to secure the legs using these screws um, now there's no visible holes or markings where the screws should sit you know what I mean like as in through the wood or the fabric so that's why you need to be standing up to apply pressure so we can screw them in correctly Assembly was super duper easy. Basically all I have to do is screw in the legs. And then once the legs are on, um, find again, remember first when we started this movie, uh, this video, we found this little thing. I mean, you can either do what I'm doing right now, just position them like that. Yeah. And my favorite part, I don't need a side table anymore. I'm super happy and proud because there's this. And those little things make a lot of difference to me. Okay, also, I know all the tools come inside this futon, but don't forget, you're gonna need this to secure the legs correctly. And it's not over yet. I'm going to tell you about the price, but it you can adjust it to many different positions. This is like awesome. It is not an outdoor couch, but hey, why not? Look at this beautiful view. Just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, 
Okay, so I'm going to play around with the settings and show you the many different ways you can use this alternative couch, this futon coming, coming from Walmart. Um, and uh, if you have any questions, I am here to answer them. Any comments, any couch that you can think of that you want me to assemble, I'm more than happy to get it and assemble it for you. Now let me tell you about the price. I got this futon delivered to my door in a box for free for under $200. Everything, tax and everything paid. So it's a great deal. It's like the best deal ever. We have a small apartment, small space. You know what? Like I said, I know it's not an outdoor, but when the weather is nice and I have like a nice, beautiful umbrella of shade, uh, to cover it, I would certainly sit outside and enjoy it and watch the video just chill. And uh, that was our assembly video. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just play around with the settings.